Hi everybody, this is Brenda Cassidy, occupational therapist, uh, dyspraxic mom of uh, two dyspraxic children and one dyslexic child. And I have a raft of sensory issues as do my children. Um, thanks so much for inviting me to give a seminar to parents of children with Down syndrome all around sensory issues. I just thought I'd make this little video to send out to you in advance uh, to let you know what I'm going to do. So basically the Brain Camp Foundations for Parents is all around the understanding of your child's sensory issues. And from my research, and I'm not an expert on Down syndrome, I can tell you, but I have a huge amount of experience in sensory issues. And from my research, about half and possibly more of children with Down syndrome um, have sensory issues. And I've found research to say that some a lot of children um, who have Down syndrome are now showing traits or, or full signs of um, autism. And autism is one condition where we will almost always see sensory disruptions or difficulties. So it's very, very relevant for yourselves. And it can be difficult to understand. So you understand as a parent the nuances of Down syndrome and it's my job to help you understand the um, ins and outs and ups and downs and all the confusion around sensory. So I'm going to try and make that as simple as possible for you um, with my Brain Cam Foundations for Parents um, webinar, okay? Um, what I decided to do was to bring you through what I bring school staff through, okay? So um, the same um, foundations course that I bring them through, I'm gonna bring you step by step so everybody's on the same page and you get to see how I train your school staff. Some of them might already be trained. If not, send the principal my details and I'm more than happy to train them online as well. So, um, that is just a little bit about the webinars. Um, I've given you a little bit extra as well because I just feel it's really, really important for you to understand this. And once you're in the driving seat and you understand the sensory difficulties as best you can, as you're not going to be an expert, but that's okay. But when you learn what the sensory issues are and then you use the sensory profiling tool that comes with the course to uh, print off and tick off, you really get into the driving seat of watching out for the triggers, the sensory triggers that are setting your child off, maybe into meltdowns. And um, so it's important for you to understand the that part. Um, what I'm going to do as a little bit of an added bonus for this is to give you a few ideas to help settle uh, the children who are very fizzy and calm the children who are very overwhelmed and to lift the arousal of children who can be uh, demonstrate low arousal. And um, I do read in my research that this can happen quite often in children with Down syndrome. So hopefully those little tips will be helpful. I do uh, provide training, as I said, for school staff in my original Brain Cam program, which is 15 minutes a day, five days a week, mostly done by SNAs in the school setting. Um, but also, I will be providing further um, training for parents all around solutions. So, this particular webinar is about the understanding, and the following webinars will be all around how to help the child sensory issues um, and all very, very down to earth, basic and uh, bits and pieces that I have used both myself as a mum, a sensory mum of sensory kids um, to help my children and myself. And I still do use them, but also um, uh, to to I've used them in hundreds of schools. So I won't teach you anything that I don't use myself or haven't used in the past myself. So there are solutions courses coming down the line online, be able to log in and do them whenever you wish, um, around the morning routine, around homework, around sleep, which is absolutely vital to get right, and around other topics such as family occasions and so on. So watch out for those on our website and they will be coming soon. But for now, um, 
take the little bit of extra time that I've given you in these courses. It was to be two hours, but it'll be about uh, two and a half there or thereabouts. You can watch an hour uh, tonight and an hour maybe tomorrow night and a half an hour another night. That's no problem. Just take your time and then go away for a few days and really take a virtual magnifying glass to your child and watch out for those sensory behaviours. Tick, Make a little uh, tick box and write them down and then um, come back to me for more solutions at another time and I'll be more than happy to hand hold you through those, okay? So bye-bye for now and I hope that you enjoy the Brain Cam Foundations for Parents course. Take care. See you again.